Welcome to Hollywood Park. And thanks for viewing my orientation video. Communication is worth starting with. What you see here is text chat. Click on the nearby chat button to the left of this white input box for chat history. You can move this box around your screen and you can also resize it to see more or less. This chat is open and anyone can see what you're saying. Polar Moon says, hello, this is local chat. This is how you chat with those avatars that are near you, as Polar Moon just did with me here. Local chat is the most used communication tool within Second Life. And chat history, as we are viewing here, is very useful. You can set up to save this chat history automatically so that you have a log of chat that you can read after your sessions. To do this, go to the top menu and click on Avatar, Preferences, Privacy tab, and make sure you have ticked Save Chat Logs. We can also chat privately using instant messages, or IM for short. You can instant message an avatar that is right beside you, but also one that is far away in Second Life. You can even I am an avatar that is offline. By default, they will see your message as an email and also see the I am when they're next online. If you right click on someone or command click if you're on a Mac, then you can choose to instant message. I am's appear in the top right hand corner of your second live screen as a small envelope. So you will see the new envelope in the top right hand corner and also in the new tab that has appeared within this window. To return to local chat, click on the nearby chat tab. You can teleport an avatar to your location using much the same system. Teleport is a way to move around Second Life quickly from location to location. A teleport is very important as this is a way for you to be found and brought safely back to Hollywood Park, for example. So, teleport appears once again as a small envelope in the top right of the screen. These envelopes or messages are very important, so do keep an eye out for them. To recap, this is how you communicate with Second Life. Nearby chat is not private and the avatar needs to be beside you or instant message, which is private and the avatar can be anywhere in Second Life or even offline. Thanks for watching.